Peace. Nice and clear. Just getting out of Penn Station. Coming from Long Island. Time to go, man. It's about 4.51. Uh, walking down Guard Avenue. Figure this is my second day on this diet, so let me get my blood flowing early in the morning. Walking, walk to work. You know what I mean? From Penn Station. Not bad. Those 20 minute walks. But I want to start by saying I see today's mathematics as being power. Power refinement. I'm gonna deal with the foundation, God. Power. Powers of the truth, God. Powers of life. Power is strength. The reason why I see power of being five is because that's the fifth point, God. You deal with the science of five, God. We all got five fingers. We got five hands. I mean five, I mean five fingers. <laughs> so we got five fingers, God. We got five points to the body. Arm, leg, leg, arm, head. We got five senses. Without strength or without power. We will not be able to use those. You know what I'm saying? We will not be able to function. We will not be able to move, God. We would not be able to bring things in existence, God, without that power, God. I also see power as being the planet Earth. And I'm going to tell you why I see that. See, the planet Earth, God, is filled with power, God, is his strength, and this is what we nurture ourselves from, God, as far as fruits, vegetables, this is why I'm on this diet now, there's a whole bunch of minerals and vitamins within that, you know, and it's nutrients, you're dealing with the science, you're dealing with earth foods, live foods, God, so, also, God, I'm going to go ahead and cross over. So also, just keep adding on. See power being the earth too, God, because the earth refines itself. See, the earth has that power, God, to bring forth life. The earth has that power to bring forth rain, hail, snow, earthquake, God, what we know and understand it's all caused by the Son of Man. But the earth has that power to replenish itself power and refinement. The earth by nature refines itself. The earth by nature brings forth life, which is another force of power, God. You know what I mean? Also see it as being equality, God, in the, in the alphabet, supreme alphabet. Today's math be equality. Sorry, I got a little darker over here on this side of the street, a little darker. But it be equality, God, because you deal with the science of the earth. The earth moves. The earth is equal on size. You know what I mean? 360 degrees. I see quality right there. It travels in a cipher. And it revolves, y'all. Uh. You know what I mean? Ew, look at that rat. But you know what I mean, God? So, boom, I'm going to start by saying the black woman, God, is the earth. She's the queen of the universe. And she has that power. You know, see, this is why we need wisdoms, God, and queens and, and herbs to keep us in order. To keep things organized, you know. Like we'll have law, but they'll keep that order. They'll keep things in, in, in a proper perspective. You know what I mean? And that's the whole science, huh? Quality. Quality means the equal all things. You know what I mean, God? You see these devils, they be doing some bullshit sciences, God, that try to throw you off course. But you know, if you got the truth, God, if you got that power, they can't, you know what I mean? They can't just come at you with any old bullshit, man. All that bullshit is crazy, God. You dealing with the science of love hella right, God? Knowledge, wisdom, understanding? If your foundation is knowledge, God, how you gonna force for some bullshit? Tell me that. You know what I mean, God? If your foundation is knowledge, how you gonna fall over some bullshit? 
All the other rest of shit is, what they say, God? Uncivilized. Everything else is uncivilized. Come on. Brother telling me that um, the Bible say that, you know what I'm saying, which I don't knock the Bible, trust me. Uh, we all know and understand it was made by the original man who was the last Supreme being black man in Asia and it expired in the year 25,000. So I'm going to add on and say, brother came up to me, told me something that it's in the Bible. I know there's somebody up there. Jesus is coming. Come on, God. Let's face it. How can you show and prove that? Like, this is something that has been brought to your attention by a slave master at that. So how are you going to believe that? How are you going to believe a liar, a raper, a murderer? Come on, man. A thief. A kidnapper. <laughs> but I'm going to just add on, man. Take this little nice stroll walk. Feel good, too. Feel real good. About to be a 40 do soon. Look, see. I mean, but I'm gonna keep adding on, dog, and um, continue later with this. I'm gonna go ahead and say peace, positive energy always creates elevation, photons, electrons always cause explosions. Peace. <laughs>